Hello Knitters. Recently I got an um, email from a student of mine and she was asking me how do you join a new ball of yarn either the same color or a different color to your work when you work in Portuguese style. You know that the, for Portuguese style you are going to rely on the tension right to perform your stitches as you are knitting. So when you run out of yarn, what happens? Let's suppose I'm happily knitting here and ran out of yarn. So I could join another ball of white yarn or I could, for example, working, be working with strand knitting and I need a new color joint on this particular spot. What I'm going to do is make a slip knot. Okay. I am going to put that slip knot on my right hand needle, give it a tight tug, and here is my new ball of yarn. In this case, I'm knitting with the blue. And again, this could be a white, would be the same color, just joining a new ball of the same color, or joining a different color. If I'm working strand and knitting, by the way, I would have this color on this pin and the color that I had before on the other pin. But that's another subject. The point is here is just to show you how to put a new ball of yarn, okay? When you're working with the new ball of yarn, which here I was working with the blue, I'm going to knit or work this project all the way around and I'm gonna come across the slip knot that I put on my round here to join the yarn. When I come across I will drop it off from the needle otherwise you are going to be adding one stitch to your count okay so you don't want to do that you want to just drop it you're going to have a tail and later on you're going to darn in your project. The same would be for uh, another ball in white. Same, same same case, same example. I'm just showing you for both uh, continue with your project or if you're doing stranded knitting and you want to put a new color, that's how you join a new ball. I hope that's clear. I hope you subscribe and give me a like. And if you have any comments, let me know. Just put it below.